Now, from your hyperlocal weather source, this is your Norcast weather update. Brought to you by Square Theaters, with locations in Northfield, Ventnor, and Stone Harbor. Experience movie watching like never before as you recline on comfortable lounge chairs and drift into another world. Get your tickets today by visiting squaretheaters.com. Hi everybody, happy Thursday. Overnight tonight we're looking cool and quiet. The temperature is falling back down into the 50s and 60s. A little bit of some patchy fog towards morning, but other than that, not too much going on overnight tonight. Tomorrow will be beautiful, another bright sunny day, a couple of scattered clouds. We're also gonna be just a little bit warmer. Those temperatures will be pushing up closer to the mid 80s, which is above average, but we're also gonna see the dew points jump back up into the 60s. And what that means is it'll be feeling a little bit more humid and almost a little bit of a throwback to the summer that we just wrapped up. Looking ahead, we are dealing with the remnants of Francine in a number of different ways. The bulk of her energy is moving up to the north and causing some pretty significant issues for the Mississippi River Valley. However, the secondary batch of energy that kind of ripped apart from Francine, that's going to cross over Florida and move into this area right off the coast of the Carolinas. That has a 30% chance over the next seven days of becoming a tropical system. That being said, we're still going to be be dealing with the moisture and with that low later on as we look forward to next week. So again, the bulk of the moisture moves up to the north, but that little bit of energy that crosses over Florida starts to kind of get a little organized. And by early next week, it starts to move onshore back towards the Carolinas. So Sunday into Monday, North Carolina, South Carolina dealing with that moisture. And then after that, as we move our way through the early part of the week, all of that energy and moisture starts to push up to the north and we'll be seeing a chance for some rain as we look forward to Tuesday. Wednesday and possibly even into Thursday. So after our nice dry stretch, we're tracking more moisture on the way. We also have another area of potential development. This little cluster of storms right here, about a 30% chance over the next two to seven days of that getting organized and becoming a tropical system. It's sitting just kind of to the east of the Leeward Islands right now, going to continue that track to the west. Then further out in the Atlantic, we have Tropical Depression 7. This is still way out as far as we're concerned, but by early next week, it'll be sitting kind of north and east of the Leeward Islands. This would be our next named tropical system. If it does become a tropical storm, it would be Gordon. 70 forecast tomorrow, this weekend, even the start of next week, bright, sunny, and dry. But as we look forward to Tuesday, Wednesday, and even into Thursday, we'll see a chance for some rain once again. Okay, hope you guys enjoy the rest of your night. Stay safe, sleep tight, and I'll be checking in with you tomorrow.